Hello water signs and welcome to my channel Indigo Goddess 1111. I'm here to bring you your Tuesday, May 8th, 2018 Love Outlook. So this will not resonate with everybody, so take what you want, leave what you don't, and as always enjoy the message. Spirit and Angels, what messages do you have for water signs, sun, moon, rising, and Venus for today, May 8th? Okay. So you guys are going to receive communication from somebody. Um, somebody that you have been waiting for to reach out to you. Somebody who has been ghosting you. Somebody who you have been hoping and praying that they um, contact you. Somebody that you've been missing. Could be a fire sign, but doesn't have to be. They're contacting you and letting you know that they have made a transformation. They have now let go of the past they have now let go of anybody that was holding on to them or them they were holding on to and they're letting you know that yeah they're letting you know that they are ready to continue on with a relationship wow because they have completed that chapter they have put the past to the past um, they have done everything they needed to do to heal, to close that book, to move forward, and they are wanting to move towards you. Could be somebody at a distance from you. Um, could be a Leo or a Taurus. It does not have to be, however. Could be a Scorpio as well. Um, really could be anybody. But they have come huge strides from where they were, and they are excited, and they are reaching out to you today. Oh my goodness. This is going to bring you so much emotional joy and love. And you're just going to be overwhelmed with, with positive emotion. Your wish is finally here. Your prayers are finally being answered. Your Ten of Cups is coming back to you. Because they have completed what they need to do in order to close that chapter, to learn that karmic lesson, and to move forward with you. For a group of you, this is your twin flame, but not everybody. This is just life partners and soulmates as well. But it's somebody that has a lot of love for you. It is somebody who is very emotional when it comes to you. They have always been at the top. You have always been at the top of their mind in their heart and they knew it was you that they were working their way towards um, you could be reaching out to a water sign but I see this as the person reaching out to you they've been enlightened there's no more confusion there's no more options there's no more manipulation they have come to this point of enlightenment and they are ready to present their cup to you they've been working hard they have all this behind them that they have worked so hard for yeah they have plenty now this is going to cause you to celebrate you're going to be reaching out to friends to family to you're just going to want to present to the world that that your person is back your person is different your person has changed but your person is better and it is it is definitely emotionally fulfilling oh wow and the queen of cups or the Queen of Pentacles. So you have the King and Queen together with the Ten of Cups. You have the Queen of Pentacles, the King of Pentacles, the Ten of Cups. This is definite soulmate or definite twin flame. Um, because you have the same King and Queen of the same suit. For me, it's automatically um, soulmates or twin flames. And then you have it paired with the Ten of Cups. It doesn't get much better than that. Yeah, you guys have worked very hard to get over this heartbreak, to get over this, um, th there was a third party at one point in time. There was, there is no more, because obviously we have death and transformation and the world closing. So that is all in the past. But you are getting over this heartbreak. You have gotten over it. It's in the past. Your king or queen is reaching out to you today. You guys have put in so much hard work um, as you see in the death card that skeleton on the bottom that is also in the bottom of the seven of pentacles so you have put in much work 
to get to this point of healing, to get to this point of letting things uh, fall to the to the wayside, what no longer was meant for you. You both have been working very hard on this um, to complete this this chapter in your life to move forward and you guys are receiving the benefits of that today you guys are receiving the blessings look at that the nine of wands your king is coming back for you or your queen is coming back for you however it goes um they are returning today for sure they are returning if not today i mean give or take a couple days obviously time is fluid but your person that you are connected with, your person that you've been waiting for, your person that you've been in separation from, they are for sure returning. They have mended this broken heart. They are ready to have a stable uh, foundation with you. And with the Ten of Cups, this is this is amazing. You have the Emperor, the highest vibra vi vibrating energy of the entire deck. Um, they are well grounded. They are stable. They are honest. They are loved by the people. They they just have their shit together, and and it's just amazing the healing that they have done in this process by taking the time to to rest and to go within, to be alone with their thoughts, to figure out for themselves what they want instead of being told what they want. And, and they have finally, they have figured it out. And even though things may not be done in a traditional way for them, it's still one that is within, it's still one that's very spiritual. It's, this is a card to me of new beginnings. Um, it has the baby, it has the key. It's, you know, looking out over their kingdom. This this is a new beginning for you guys and like I said it may not be the most traditional way to do things but that's okay because it's it's your way um, and it's still going to bring lots of happiness with your ten of cups and it's still going to be successful um, because the time has been taken to move forward in a positive direction and allowing this um, chapter to to come to an end so, yeah, wow. And on the back, or on the bottom of your deck is the seven of wands on the reverse. So you are no longer sticking around where people no longer value you, where you feel like you have to prove your worth, where you feel like you have to defend your place in their life. Um, you're no longer dealing with that. You are moving forward to a place where you no longer have to... Um, constantly de defend your value in somebody's life so that is all I have for you water signs for Tuesday May 8th I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I'll see you next time